hello, hello. I'm Reverend Sharon, and welcome to this week's Sunday Inspiration. And what I'm going to talk about today is, do you ever feel that you're you're just kind of living in a wheel, like you're, it's, it's um, deja vu, that you're living Groundhog Day over and over again. Nothing seems to be changing, nothing seems to be happening, and you feel really, really stuck. Or you might experience where something is new and different and exciting all of the time and it's really, really joyful. And in that case, you're moving forward. But the thing is, we happen to get really, really stuck. And here's the thing is, we cannot move forward if we keep talking about what is, we keep focused on the path, the path, (laughs) the past, all right? So if we stay focused on the past, remember that's in the rear view mirror, we've already drawn past it. But here's the thing is, where we are right now in this moment in time, And what we like to call the present is we've also created a reality that is based on the past. So we manifested where we are right now. Woo woo! We are always in this opportunity to grow, to go beyond that. But it's going to match up with that vibration. But if we're always talking about our troubles, how bad things are, if we get in our head and struggling because things aren't going well, or maybe we feel like we don't have enough money to pay the rent, or that we don't know if we're going to be recovered from a certain situation, which could be um, a breakup, it could be a health issue. And if we're focused in that vibration, all we're doing is keeping that there. And here's the thing is that we are these magnificent beings that are here to be creators and our soul cannot not grow. I want you to hear that. Our soul cannot not grow. So here's the truth is that we're always going to be put in an uncomfortable position because our soul is always wanting to manifest more. And it gives us that understanding of needing to go bigger and better and to create more because we are here to do that. And we get so caught up in what we consider this reality that, okay, there's not enough food to go around, there's a drought, there are fires all over, nobody can afford to live, the earth is going to blow up or it's gonna flood itself. It's not true. Those are the realities that we're holding onto because we're at that vibration. But the universe has planned everything accordingly. I meant like our moon, um, our moon, the, the earth is in the right position to be able to get fuel from the sun without being all burnt up. It, the moon helps with the flow and gives us light in the darkness. So everything is consciously created and we have all of that DNA within us. But we can't move forward if we're gonna stay hung up on the past, if we're not willing to change, if we're not willing to expand, if we're not willing to grow. And it, my friends, is going to come with a level of discomfort. However, the more joy that we have in our life, and Catherine Ponder, wonderful writer, wonderful minister, but she would say when something would happen, I can't wait to see what good comes from this. And so when we can take a situation and say, wow, this is, something else is happening, something else is better. And I recently wrote an article about elimination and illumination, which are the same things, because each thing in our life that's being eliminated is also an illumination to what is coming next. Because the universe wants our best interest, it's going to set us up for the highest and the best if we are willing to move through that process and talk about what is coming. So good is coming to me, there's peace on earth. And of seeing it, feeling it, and stating it, there is peace on earth, not everybody's at war and we're gonna blow ourselves up, right? Because how does that feel compared to saying there's peace on earth? I live in a peaceful world. I live in an abundant world. I live in a state of joy. All of my desires are made manifest and I share that with others. I help others to grow and to find their joy. When we say things like that, where does that put us? What is the difference? What is the difference, right? And so with every problem, there is a solution. But if we focus on the problem, the problem's bigger and bigger. But if we focus on the solution, what's gonna get me through this today? What can I do that's joyful? And sometimes it's going ahead and giving yourself permission to do that something today. So you can't move forward 
You cannot move forward if you're focused on the past. You cannot move forward if you keep talking about, well, this is my reality. This is my reality and this is how everything is and this is just what it is. Yes, that is that physical reality at the moment, but you have the power to rewrite the script and to change it. So now is the time. There is no better time than now to rewrite your script and to step into your beingness and your birthright. Have a marvelous day. Thank you for sharing with me and thank you for supporting me through Patreon. Really appreciate it. The link is below. Namaste.